It's very exciting new technology because it opens up the uh, prospect of vision correction to patients and clients that may previously have been ineligible for having laser vision correction or who just felt uncomfortable with laser vision correction because laser vision correction is still uh, surgery. It does remove some tissue from the surface of the eye, the cornea. It's some uh, uh, re-sculpting of the cornea and Pixel allows us to reshape the cornea without removing any tissue, without being invasive and provides us with an option of uh, effectively non-invasive treatment that at the same time increases the strength of the cornea. It particularly is for people who have a relatively low refractive error who can get really bothered because they need glasses just for driving or for certain activities and nothing else and it's not really worth their while to uh, go through the whole process of laser vision correction and this gives them an opportunity to correct their vision without having to go and pursue the path of laser vision correction. The technology that underlies it has been around for uh, several decades in various areas of medicine in terms of treating the eye for strengthening the cornea. It's been around for uh, about 20 years altogether um, in terms of an actual bona fide uh, proper refractive treatment. It's been uh, proved in Canada for the last year and in Europe for, I believe, two years. You cannot provide cutting-edge technology that's 25 years old, it's no longer cutting-edge. Uh, we can assure them that any technology that gets approved by Health Canada is very thoroughly vetted and has to meet very extensive criteria before it gets approved. So the approval process is typically years in the coming and involves uh, follow-up data uh, of patients having had the treatment, having been followed for several years and proven the outcome over time as well as the safety. So we can be very comfortable that Health Canada will not approve something of that nature unless it was thoroughly vetted and approved. To be practically independent of glasses for their distance vision and to have the refractive error corrected. Now, are they going to have super eagle vision as it might be feasible with some process of laser vision correction? No, that's not the purpose of it, uh, nor the cost of it. Uh, the purpose is to give them the independence from glasses uh, without any major exposure to significant risk and uh, in a most minimally invasive way. Because I'm always excited to be able to offer something that is cutting edge but proven to be safe. And uh, the less invasive I can provide a solution, it is always a better thing. And the world is progressing, it's progressing towards um, smaller but better and in quotes bigger things so I think that this is one of the stepping stones to get us there to something even better for the right patient.